Hi, this is Steve. Uh, just a real quick review. I just came back from seeing Man of Steel, and I wanted to make a few comments. I love the film. I know a lot of people uh, had problems with it, and you would think that someone who's been reading comics for uh, probably about more than 50 years uh, might have more problems with the things that were done with Superman, but I didn't. Um, I thought that... Um, first of all, uh, Henry Cavell nailed it. I, I I thought he was good as he was good as Clark, and uh, I thought he was good as Kal El. Um, Superman. The, the the fight scenes were amazing. Uh, Michael Shannon as General Zod uh, nailed it. I mean, he was he. It could have easily been one of those characters that were, was chewing the scenery all over the place, but he didn't. Uh, you actually uh, you, you could, didn't really feel sympathy for the character, but as he's, he himself said, he was, he was bred to defend Krypton. That's what he was trained for, and that's what he was raised to do. Uh, the whole uh, thing with uh, the main plot of uh, the story is that uh, Kryptonians are raised to be of a particular type. Some are raised to be scientists, some are raised to be uh, warriors, um, etc. And anyway, um, Cal El is truly uh, Krypton's last hope. And one way or the other, Zod is going to ensure that Krypton, even though the planet is no longer, um, Krypton will uh, will continue, even if he has to create a new Krypton here on Earth. Um, I really don't think I'm giving anything away at this point. Is the the ending of the film after amazing fights and, and, and a lot of destruction and I know people are having uh, have trouble with that um, I mean you can only imagine the uh, amount of um, casualties in in these battles that they're having um, but in a way it's 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 the way these comic book things are. Um, unfortunately, I, you know, it's, uh, you know, I mean, it's like, I don't know. Anyway, um, yeah, was it, were those over the top? And did you kind of wonder, well, geez, you know, a lot, I mean, millions, I mean, billions of dollars of destruction. Um is goes on and, and you see uh, you really only see maybe a half dozen people being rescued some by Superman some by by others uh, anyways um, I enjoyed the film I really think that they are have are going to create a, a franchise uh, so unlike some people, I thought that the the uh, the the moments with Clark and Lois were uh, were genuine. I, I I thought there was emotion there. I thought there was a growing respect among the characters. I don't have a problem with her knowing uh, who Clark uh, who Clark is. You know, so you you just sort of. You know, you, you eliminate what, you know, that old, you know, comic book subplot. And, yeah, like, like, like another reviewer said is basically you've skipped the first couple of seasons of The Adventures of Lois and Clark. And you've you know, just gone right from, you know, Lois knows. I don't have a problem with that. Um, Clark coming in. And, and to uh, becoming a member of the planet staff. I guess they had to do it. You know, 
and I'm I'm fine with that. You know, I, I thought everyone was great. Um, Kevin Costner was was good as as Pa Kent. Uh, Diane Lane as as Ma Kent was good. Um, Lawrence Fishburne as as Perry White, he was good. The 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 incidental characters, I, I thought everyone was was did really great, and it was it was nice. Uh, poor Pete Ross, man, uh, is certainly not the character that we remember from the comics, if you remember Pete Ross from the comics. But, you know what? Um, I liked it. <laughs> I get a kick out of it. Anyway, I'm, I'm giving it, um, I'm going with three stars. Was it the, the greatest uh, superhero movie? No. But man, it was better than Iron Man two. It was, I I mean, green, the Green Lantern, Green Lantern, was a joke next to this. Of course, it was a joke to begin with. Um, anyways, I liked it. I recommend you go out and you and you see it and you know, put your memories of of Christopher Reeve and George Reeve. And, and 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 the comics aside, and go in there and just say, okay, this is this is how Superman is now, and have fun, you know. And, and I really did. I I enjoyed it. I sat there, and I I wasn't wiggling around in my seat. I wasn't looking at my watch, and uh, you know. Um, I didn't even finish, finish off my soda. But it was good. I, you know, I when you come out of the movies and you feel good about it and the, you want to immediately tell everybody, oh, man, that was excellent. I had fun. Go to the movies. Have some fun. Peace out. Thanks for listening.